Diazoc side. Its FDA approval date is May 28, 1976. Label the indication hyperinsulinemic hypoglycemia for the management of hypoglycemia due to hyperinsulinism due to certain conditions such as in adults, inoperable islet cell adenoma or carcinoma, extra pancreatic malignancy, and the conditions in infants and children such as leucine sensitivity, islet cell hyperplasia, extra pancreatic malignancy, islet cell adenoma, adenomatosis. Diazoxide may be used preoperatively as a temporary measure and postoperatively if hypoglycemia persists. Mechanism of action Diazoxide opens ATP dependent potassium channels on pancreatic beta cells in the presence of ATP and magnesium, resulting in hyperpolarization of the cell and inhibition of insulin release. Diazoxide binds to a different site on potassium channel than sulfonyl urease. Diazoxide crosses the human placenta and appears in cord blood. Altered carbohydrate metabolism, hyperbilirubinemia, and thrombocytopenia have been reported in fetus or neonate. Alopecia and hypertrichosis lanuginosa have been also reported in infants following the maternal use of diazoxide during the last 19 to 60 days of pregnancy. Hypoglycemic onset of action for the oral dosage form within one hour and the duration less than eight hours. The product half-life elimination for infants, children and adolescents 5.9 hours to 27.7 hours and for adults 24 to 36 hours.